Hello viewers, 4DIYers here with another tutorial video for everyone. In this particular video here, I'll be doing a demonstration on how to replace the plastic threaded insert on a BMW's trunk tool tray. Don't forget to check out my website at www.4diyers.com and subscribe to my social media pages such as Google+, Twitter, Facebook, and Instagram. Links are all included in the description below. I have made a tutorial on how to replace the plastic fastener, which I will include in the description below. The plastic threaded insert can also wear out or fatigue over time, not allowing the tool tray to hold into place. The replacement can be done with minimal tools. You can usually use the tools supplied in the factory tool kit if need be. Remove the fabric trim. This will allow us to get better access to the threaded insert. I have already removed the tool kit as I made a parts order online, so it did take a few weeks for this to arrive. I didn't want to put added strain on my tool kit, so I just removed it all together. I will show how it's connected in a moment. Once you have the fabric trim removed, then unclip the trunk light. Here's the three clips on each side which holds the fabric into place. The opposite side just tucks in behind the plastic trim piece that has the pull handle. Next use interlocking pliers and wrap the tips in tape so it doesn't scratch the paint on the inside of the trunk lid. Now squish the plastic insert and maneuver it out of its location. This can be a little tricky, as once one side is unclipped, it may pop back into place when you're trying to work with the opposite corner. And finally it's removed. Here is the new replacement, and as you can see it does have four slits to allow for it to contract when pushing it into the hole. It expands once it's clipped into place. Push the new threaded insert into place. The orientation doesn't matter, it's the same all the way around. Feed the light through the fabric trim panel first, and then clip it into place. Tuck the fabric panel back in behind the plastic trim panel. You may need to smack the clips into place. Ensure the clips are lined up with the holes first. If you do not, you do risk breaking them. Now the factory tool kit can be reinstalled. It's only connected with four Phillips screws across the bottom, which have plastic caps. The plastic caps can be tricky to remove as they do snap on quite tight. I found a small standard screwdriver works best for removal. Then a plastic strap also holds the tray into the center and this simply just clips into its location. New videos are uploaded every week to my channel. So subscribe to this YouTube channel by clicking on the button below the video. This concludes the rest of my video. Be sure to give me a thumbs up, and if you have any comments, please feel free to post them. Thank you for watching.